and down, you idiot! Partner, we come in really use your knack for diplomacy right now. Speak to the Skull King before we start a war. Sure, save me from fools and profit. Will no one properly greet a weary traveler? I know that there's little love between East and West, but now is not the time to be picking a fight. Lyris's report on the rise of Greyhost had my father preparing for the worst. When we hadn't received word for some time, he decided... Stargrim. It's hard to believe the rumors were true. I didn't know him well, but I can't understand how anyone could throw away everything for the promise of power. What? You'd have to ask him. As far as I can tell, the Western Holds are in chaos. They could use a king who cares for his fellow Nords, but if the welcome we've received here is any in... A oh, familiar face. Maybe you can talk some sense into these Western milk drinkers. We're not a damn invasion. We're here to help. Do you know what's going on? So the rumors are true. Svargrim joined the Grey Host. I knew he had ambitions, but to throw away his humanity like that, it's inconceivable. Svargrim once told me that he would die before welcoming me to solitude. I suppose he was right. That's why I sent Lyris here in the first place. I'm not the king of these holds, though. I can't do anything if they refuse my help. Svargrim despised me. He would never accept my aid. But Svana... Ah, here she comes now. Let's see what she has to say. We have no need of help that involves welcoming your soldiers within our walls. My walls, Jarl. My father may have been willing to slap aside the helping hand, but I'm not. Permit me a word with your envoy, Skald King. Thank you. For holding the line, I mean. I'm ready to do what I should have done a long time ago. To do what my father never could. I'll speak with the Skald King. There's one more thing I'd like you to do while I entertain our guests. We saved Solitude, but our war with the Grey Host is far from over. We need Fen's Elixir more than ever. With that, and King Yorin's help, we might just push these monsters back into their grave for good. That depends on Fen. If there's a Fen is with old Mjolin at the moment. Genius. A rare thing to find an elf with the makings of a clever woman. Despite what my kin might proclaim, it's not all in the blood. Ah, good, you're here. We've made a friend. I was just discussing a theory with Mjolin, and it seems like we're very close to... A cure. Singolus's research on the nether route showed me just how it weakens the connection between a body and its soul. Thus far, I've been able to inure a person to the root, but now I'm certain I can use that knowledge. Well, it is just a theory at this point. There's a lot more testing and experimentation to be done before we can produce a viable antidote. We... I know, I know. We can't simply put things on hold. Mjoland and I have a batch brewing right now, and materials to keep producing for another day. Ingert's promised us a steady supply of Arkay's oil, but that's not our limiting factor. 
We know enough about Singolus's refinement processes to replicate his methods, but we still need a source of netherroot to do so. Tell Svana that if she can keep us supplied, we can produce enough elixir for all the holds in a matter of weeks. We can ransack Greyhost stockpiles, or mount an expedition into Blackreach. Otherwise, it would take decades of work to produce a proper crop. After we get the elixir squared away, we'll turn our attention to curing the Herod. Indeed. As I surmised, the Grey Reliquaries contained the remains of ancient Greyhost warriors. They served as a connection to the souls trapped in Cold Harbor. I believe the stone husks are incubators of a sort. The physical... I was hoping you'd return before we began. Tell me you've got good news. I feel a lot better delivering a speech about healing and hope, knowing that we're on the road to recovery. What did Fen have to say about it? Not the best news, but I'll take it. So long as we have enough to protect our soldiers, we have a fighting chance against the Grey Host. I'll go to the... Now that would be cause for celebration. If he can really bring back even a fraction of those we lost to the Hero Storms, I'm willing to try. That's all I needed to hear. We should begin the ceremony before the crowd. Nothing fancy. Just a traditional Nord wake. To mourn and celebrate those we've lost, and cherish the lives we still have. I'd like you to join us. None of us would be here to sing dirges for the dead or celebrate the living if not for you. I certainly wouldn't be here, ready to leave my hold. You've supported me since I started down this path. I'm honored to have you here at the end. Sons and daughters of Skyrim, we have... ...dead. Honor to the fallen! Sons and daughters of Skyrim, our trials were fierce, but we are still here. We stand and we remain! Now... We raise our voices to tell Sovereign Guard of the coming of the worthy dead. And to tell the world that the Nords are still here. We are still standing. The Fallen now march home to hallowed halls. To join our ancestors in boundless strength and song and brawls. Let sound the horns that peal the bells that loose the ancient hymn. We will remain until time ends, we children of Skyrim.